anybody in the house? Who is there? Ah. Mazuzoma. Mazuzoma. Norma, is anything the matter? Why are you here? Why, please. I've come because of my money. Please, I come in peace. Is that why you're barging into my compound without any atom of respect? Eh, uh, Norma, look, are we mates? Eh? Norma, are we mates? Why have you come to give me bad fortune this morning? I don't have money. Go. When I have it, I will summon you. Azuzoma, it has not gotten to this now. Please, I'm begging you. I'm on my knees. Hmm? If I've called your name disrespectfully, I'm sorry. Eh? I'm sorry. You see, there's no food in my house. Please, I need that money before hunger crushes me and my daughter. Bikonu. Norma. Norma. Look, stop pretending. You know what other widows are doing. I'm not the only one owing you in this town. Neither are you the only widow in this village. Eh? Stop pretending. I don't have money. If I have money, I will send for you. Mazi. Mazi, remember that God is up there watching you and me. I know you have the money. Go in there and give me Bikonu. Please, I'm begging you. Bikonu. Ah. Please give me my money. So you want to tell me I'm a wicked man, eh? Norma. Oh, yeah. Let Jesus and God come and give you money or food. Pretend Papa, precious mother deserves pity. Ah. Yes, Papa. Eh, hey, Papa, you would have given it to her. Her condition is pitiable. Tell me what to do. The two wise ones. Do you know if I have the money? Papa, you have the money. Yes, you would have given it to her. I have the money. Yes, Papa. I'll give it to her to open her space. Oh yeah, go inside. Go inside. Go inside. Go inside. My dear, what do I do? This is our means of survival. Hey, yeah. Don't worry, everything will be alright, okay? But for your health, precious, you need some rest. If I do, my mother and I will starve. If my father is still alive. Okay, could you believe that my mother works for people in this village? And after they will owe her. Since morning, she wants to retrieve a debt. And I don't know whether they are going to give it to her. Hey, people are very wicked. How could someone who knows the mother's condition in this village seize their money? This is absolute wickedness. They are heartless. I have to be on my way now. This firewood is heavy. Um, moreover, my customers will be waiting for me. With God, nothing is impossible. Okay? I'll come and see you later. Bye bye. Yes, madam, what is the problem?
Yes, madam. What can I do for you? You will have been overpowered and humiliated by my Zuzoma. What did he do to you? I worked for him in his farm three weeks ago. He didn't pay me. This morning I went to his house to collect my money. He started beating me and pushing me out of his compound. Why would he do that? And who is this Mazi Uzoma? He is from Badili clan in Umugama. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know him. But please, calm down. Calm down. God, you will follow madam. She will take you to the house of this uh, Mazi Uzoma. When you get there, madam, you will point him out. Then you, God, you will tell him that I want to see him immediately. Yes, Your Highness. Good. Thank you, Igwe. Thank you. Precious baby. Welcome. Precious, why is your face like that? I'm worried about my mother. She's not yet back from where she went to retrieve some debts. Why not go there if you know the place? Eh, uh, I know. It's at Mazu's Oma's house. I've gone there, but they told me she left some minutes ago. That is why I'm so worried. It's all right. Don't worry. She may have gone to an important place. Cheer up. Your mother is not a kid. She will be back soon, okay? Just cheer up. Okay. Please come and sit down. Thank you. Where were you coming from? I was coming from my house. My mother is not around, so I decided to come and see you. Thank you. This is your wicked plan, eh? Norma, after all I have done for you, you went and reported me to Igwe. Ah, Norma, this is wicked of you. Mazi Zoma, Igwe said you should come to his palace now. Yes. No problem. I will go with you. Let me put on my shirt. Be fast about it. Go inside, eh? Continue with whatever you are doing. I'll be back soon. Don't worry, eh? Huh? That's Igwe, this is Mazi Uzoma. Mazi Uzoma, come. This poor widow reported that you refused to pay her after she had worked for you. 
Rather, you started beating her when she went to ask for her money. Igwe, I didn't beat her. I paid her some money. And I pleaded with her to, to give me time to complete the payment. Igwe, but she kept disturbing my peace. But that was not the arrangement before she started the work. Look at her. She's a widow. And you have owed her this money for several weeks. Now I am ordering you to pay her within the next one week. I will pay her, Igwe. And don't ever let me hear anything like this again against you. Do I make myself clear? Yes, Your Highness. You may go. Igwe. Igwe, thank you. Thank you. You are most welcome. Madam, please come. Is that the kind of job you do for people? Yes, my queen. I have a farmland and I want you to work for me. Thank you, my queen. Thank you, Igwe. You're welcome. The truth, Norma is a very good woman. I was in tightening fear. She would tell the Igwe I asked her out. But she didn't. This woman can keep secret. Should I continue to persuade her? No. Norma is so strict. I have faith in Jesus Christ. I will obey the Igwe and save my face. this place. So you now tell me, check it and tell me how much you collect. Ah, don't worry my queen. I and my daughter will start work tomorrow. Just give us anything from your heart. Anything? Yes my queen. Oh, that would be wonderful. That would be wonderful. Anyway, no problem. I'll be coming around to check you from time to time. Thank you. Thank you man. Take care of yourself. Um, which way are you going to so that my driver could help me? This way. This way? Have you been? I've searched for you everywhere in this village. Mama, you kept me worried. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Do you know what? I went to Mazuzoma's house to collect my money. But he pushed me out of his compound. What? Yes, he did. And I had no option than to report him to the Igwe. Yes. Mama, you did well. But do you know what? Igwe summoned him and compelled him to pay me the money within the week. Yes, that serves him right. That man is very wicked. As if you know. He is. Adam. Mama. I have good news for you. What, Mama? Guess, no guess. Tell me, Mama. No guess. Oh, mama, tell me. <laughs> Do you know Igwe's second wife? Mm -hmm. Lolo took me to a very big farmland and offered us a job to wait it. Hey! Oh. I know. 
least Lolo is not going to be as wicked as Mazuzoma. You know. I have the assurance that she's not going to owe us. That's why I'm happy. Mama, please. <laughs> <laughs> please, let's go inside. I prepared Mpataka for you. I do you, you. I do be care. You're back already. Oh, you mean you have finished the whole farmland? Because when I came, you were the middle. Uh, yes, my queen. Are you serious? Uh, yes, my queen. You, you can send your guards to go and check it. It's cleared everywhere. Oh, anyway, I have no doubt. Because I saw the way both of you were attacking the weeds. It shows me a positive strength and seriousness. And I must confess, your daughter is so strong and hardworking. Thank you, my queen. You're welcome, my dear. Um, okay, that. Please take them back. I'll join you later. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Especially her daughter. That little girl is so good. I think that's the type of girl we need to train in our family. Mm. If only her poor mother will agree to let her out of her sight. I believe she will. I'll talk to her anyway. I can't stand watching the life of that little girl being ruined because of poverty. Alright. No, it would be good if she agrees. Have they gone? Oh, no, they're outside. I came to plead for their money. How much is their money? The woman said I can give her anything my mind tells me. Oh, 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 isn't that nice of her? Wonderful. Oh. So how, how much do you want to give her? Mm, 5,000 naira, I believe, would be fair. Yes, I agree, I agree. Uh, take 5,000 there. Thank you. Oh. I said take 5,000. Men and I know. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Mama, this food is so delicious. Yes. Yes. The queen is a very nice woman. Yeah. She's very nice. All like the other people <clears throat> we work for. None of them has ever given us food after working for them. Yes, my daughter, you're right. She's a very nice woman. Oh, God, I want you to bless her. Oh, madam, my queen. Oh, please, if you're not okay, ask for more free free. <laughs> Thank you, my queen. It's Thank okay. You. Thank you. Mm. Okay, here is your money. It's 5,000 naira. 5,000 naira? Hey. 
Thank you, Lon. Sit down. Thank you. Please, 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 please. Please. Thank you, my queen. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Thank you. Madam, I must confess I appreciate your daughter so well. She is a very smart and intelligent girl. And very hardworking too. And I don't know how it will affect you if I ask her to come and live with us here in the palace. Live here? Hey, thank you, my queen. Thank you. Please, please. please. It's okay. Thank you, love. Hey, hey, my queen. Thank you very much. May God bless you. You too. Bless you. I'm short of words. I don't know how to thank you. You see, she is the only one I labor to feed. And if you take her, I have only my stomach to fend for. My queen, thank you. You're welcome, you're welcome. My dear, would you like to come and live with us? We'll send you to school. <coughs> Lolo, <coughs> I would love to. It's just that I'll be missing mama. Oh, that won't be any problem. Unless if um, I can be going home to see my mama. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, my dear, you see, uh, that won't be a problem. I will, I will just ask the driver to take your people back and bring her home. Uh, whenever you want, you can go and visit your mother and come back. Okay? Thank you, love. Thank you. Thank Thank you. Take care of yourself. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. You're going to live here. My daughter, you're going to live here. Come, I'm happy. I'm happy. You live here. Go. Can I thank you? My daughter, you're going to. Can I thank you? I'm so happy. I'm 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 happy. My prince, are you still doing this? Huh? Don't you get tired? My prince, I'm used to work, okay? And moreover, I'm not tired. Precious, you're still cleaning the house? My queen, I'm not used to staying idle. Let me be doing this. When I get tired, I don't need anyone to plead with me to rest. Go in, take your bath and eat. Rest, okay? Okay, Your Highness. Let me see you do it now. She's hard working. Right there. That was what prepared me to bring her the first place. You're back? Yes. Precious. Ah, Mama, good day. Susan, Mama. is that you? Yes, Mama. How are you? Mama, I'm fine. <laughs> what about Precious? Did she go to the farm? Ah, Precious, your friend, is favored by God. She now lives in the palace with Igwe. What? What is she doing in the palace? My dear. She's now living with Tibe and the family. She's now a royal girl. <laughs> this is something beautiful. God is wonderful. You really know that Precious needed that. I'm so happy for her. I'm so happy, my daughter. I'm so happy. <laughs> I'm, happy I'm so happy. Do you know what? Igwe promised me that he's going to send my daughter to school. Finish her secondary school. Take her to university. <laughs> I'm so happy. Mama, you'll be feeling lonely. Anyway, I will come and check you from time to time. I keep you company. Thank you. And you can as well send for me anytime you need any assistance. Thank you, my daughter. Thank you very much. Yes, ma'am. What about your mother? She's fine. She's okay. Yeah, thank you. Mm -hmm. I will be on my way. Yeah, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. My regards to her when you get some. Okay, mama. Thank you. Okay, mama. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm. Okay, bye-bye. Your Highness, 
Precious is a hard working girl. The longer she stays in the palace, the more I love her. I wish she's my biological daughter. I mean, she's one in a million. So, my dear, you have found out what I saw in that girl. And her mother is very lucky. She's the only child. Mm. Really? Her only child. But you know, that poor girl is used to working hard. She has been well brought up and she's taken to it. Your Highness, you sent for me. Yes, yes. It is concerning your education. Uh, now, remind us, um, where did you stop? I stopped at SS2. Oh, mm. SS2. Almost finished. Mm. Oh, very well. Um, tomorrow morning, you wake up early, get yourself ready, because you are going back to school. Thank you so much, <laughs> Thank you. And uh, if you continue to do well, as your report says, I can assure you the sky is the limit. You can study to whatever level you choose. Thank you, Your Highness. You are Thank you. And which of you will be able to escort her to oh, school? Oh, I will. When we finish here, we come so I give you some money. And um, <coughs> her wardrobe too needs to be improved, don't you think? <laughs> so we buy, buy some, some clothes. Thank you, Your Highness. You are welcome. Thank you. You may go. How about Junior? He's inside. It's okay. Thank you, Your Highness. You're welcome. Um, She's so happy. I just okay. wanted to say that um, uh, we can move right away from the servants, don't you think? Not one of us. One of us. Good. Yeah, so she changes her uniform. Yes? Agreed? Accept it. Agreed? <laughs> What's going on? But I told you that. You, you told me what? You told Frank, me what? Frank, please. I want you to help us and take us to Precious School. As you can see, there's no other car left here. Moreover, the driver left with the race car. Well, I'm sorry you have to wait for another car. Uh, in Precious. When? Why, why am I going to take her to school? For what? When did that start? When did that start? Give me my key, my friend. Give me my key, man. Frank, what are you trying to I do? I have a meeting. Frank! But our friend is so strict. Eh? This is wickedness. What an insult. What an insult. Oh. No, ma. Mama, where are you, Mama? Ah, that's it, Mama. <laughs> You're welcome. Mama, don't welcome me. Don't you dare welcome me. You went and reported me to Igwe. This is your money. Mama, you are in trouble. You are in big trouble. Hunger will kill you and your so-called daughter. Hey. Let me see how you work for me again. What's this, Mama? What's this, Mama? Why are you shouting? Eh? You know how long you've owned me this money? Eh? Well, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hmm? I'm sorry. Sorry for yourself. Anyway, Mama, we shall see. Why are you talking like this now? Eh? I worked for this money. This is my labor. I would think it is my money. Okay, let's get it on. Cheated. Yes, you cheated. And you're so proud to cheat. 30 cards. Too late, too late, too late. It's your time to lose. You know that. Hey, okay. Up? Hey, brother. You're back, man. I'm a big brother. How's your day? Awesome. Hi, guys. Hello, Jennifer. Yeah. You're welcome. Thank you. Welcome, my friends. We'll be upstairs. 
son. All right, man. Just do your thing, all right? Please, um, I'm coming. I'll be right back. Let me get his food. All right, don't worry. We'll wait. Nice. Both sides, baby. We'll be each other. Trust me, my brother. I can't wait to see them get married. I pray so. I pray so. That day, yeah. That day, what will happen? <laughs> and you find your own wife. Yes, uh, I know. Yes. Yes. What is it? Huh? What? Can't you see out of this stuff? Something wrong with you? Must it be now? You want to interfere? Are you sick? My prince, I did not come to the store. <laughs> Just that I brought your food. And I come for the food? What is it? Frank, what is it? I only came to inform him about his food and he started shouting at me. It's okay. Hmm? Let's go. Frank. For how long will you continue to be harsh on that girl? She's grown up for God's sake. She's no longer a kid. With all due respect, I have a vista. I don't want to see that thing next to my room. Okay. I understand all you say. I'm now actually in the park. I'll let you know if I'm coming up. Precious, why are you frowning your face? What is the matter? What is it? It's Frank. I knocked on his door to tell him about his food and he started shouting at me. Frank. Frank is too proud. Psst. I don't know when my brother will realize that Precious has come of age. Precious. I'll talk to him. Okay? Choose. We shuffle the card. Hmm? Let's go. This is my turn to shine. Eh? <laughs> Just watch out. Watch out and see. I'm gonna win. Who is from of this? Huh? Why is she looking for me? Am I not old enough to walk around? Do my own business? Jokes, you are mommy's baby and you are her last issue. Therefore, she loves you so much. So, where did you see him? Mom, I went to Uncle Oza's place. Your food is getting cold. <laughs> Come on, go. So, you mean you are looking for me because of food? Forget it. Jokes, so apart from food in this house, nothing else matters to you in this palace. Follow me. Mom, I'm not going to be a baby. I don't feel to walk around and do my own business. Huh? Please choose. For the mommy. Now. <laughs> Thank God you know I'm a big boy. One of these days, I will get married and have children. Mm. Okay? And you and mommy will stop pestering around me. Go in, big boy. Big boy. Yeah. <laughs> I've noticed that Precious is such a good girl. And uh, I don't want you to get upset over what I'm going to say now. My son, go ahead, say it. Talk to your mother. Mom, this may seem a slap or disgrace on the royal household. But the truth is that I'm in love with Precious. And mother, I want to marry her. Oh. My son. Mother. That's my boy. Huh? That's wonderful. Yes. Really? See. It's not a slap. 
Rather, it is a welcome development. Okay. And uh, Precious has been the girl after my heart. Have you told her? Not yet. I decided to seek your consent first. Oh no. Go ahead. Tell her immediately. I will, Mom. <gasps> Thank you very much. I can't wait to tell His Royal Highness. I'm happy. Okay. Ah, my dear, how are you? I'm fine, Your Highness. Good, good, good. good. Thank you. You can go now. Yes, my queen. Why are you looking at her like that? You know, this girl has made me forget that I don't have a female child. Mm. You know, the first time I set my eyes on her, oh, I wished. And I still wish that one of my sons would find her worthy to take as a wife. Igwe, you are right. Even me. I feel the same way too. But what can we do? Just leave it to God. He knows the best. <laughs> Let's hope for him. And God, he knows how to do things. Oh, it's okay. Oh, precious. Okay. Sit down. Your mother said you want to see me. Yes. One second. Mm. Precious. You know you've been very close to this royal household and me for quite some time now. Love it. I love the palace. I'm glad you do. I I don't know how to start or how to go about what I want to tell you now. But I'm sure when I'm done you would understand me. I hope you wouldn't be bad if I let you know what I feel for you. Feel for me? Yes. Precious, I, I love you, and it's a true love, born out of pure heart. Um, my prince, I don't say anything. I know what you want to say, but I want you to know that I'm not deceiving you. This is for real. In you, I see my life, my everything. And all I want to do is to make you my wife. My prince, I don't believe you. I'm still too young for marriage. Moreover, I want to finish my education. My dear, age is just a number. What matters in marriage is love. If you love me the way I love you, I wouldn't mind waiting for you to round up with your education and come of age. My prince, are you serious? I am very serious. Um, please, um, let me go. I have to think about it. Please, let me go. I hope you make it snappy. Okay, my friends.
moment. Chooks, I've been listening to two of you and I still don't get it. I don't get it. I mean, what are you asking me to do? And what does everyone see in this precious girl anyways? And to top it all, you know I don't have a healthy, perfect relationship with her under the same roof. So what, uh, what are you telling me? Frank, you have to do away with all the things you don't like about Precious. And begin to see the good qualities in her. She is a wife material. You see, that is the point. How can you be telling me to get married to Precious when you know I've been dating Jennifer for a long time? See, big bros, there is no sentiment in marriage. Huh? Precious is just good for you. Okay? Now listen to this. Your father has promised a surprise package for any of his sons who marries Precious. He even promised more. Mom, what else can father promise? No, tell me. Everyone in this kingdom knows that at the end of the day, I will be king and I will inherit the throne. So, listen, brother. This is not about the throne. It's about the king's heart. Our daddy's heart. Good talk, Chooks. Frank, you know that you can inherit the throne, which is your right as a first son. But if Val, your half-brother, inherits both the throne and your father's love by marrying Precious, what will become of you, my son? Think about it. All right, uh, okay. Uh, I'll, I'll see what I can do to work something around, you know, having a relationship with Precious. But, but it's not going to be easy, though. <sighs> Still, I will try not to disappoint you. Yes! That's my son. I won't wait to tell your father about this. You <laughs> <laughs> can dance, dance, dance. Dance for me. My dear, you know, my prayers have been answered. Which shows that my ancestors are always with me. Oh, I know my children. Val has decided to make me happy. You know, I have always seen smartness and wisdom in that boy. I was so happy when he came to tell me, Mama, I'm in love with Precious. You can see it in his eyes. Oh, I will bless that boy. Oh, yes. Tell him to come and see me. Immediately. Immediately, yes. Oh, hey, yeah, 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 hey, hey, hey. What is going on? You will, why are you dancing? Have you been awarded the best ruler in the state? My dear, I have been favored. My God has favored me. How could that be? My wish has been granted. And Val has granted it by declaring Precious worthy to marry. I see. Well, that is why I'm here, Igwe. What? I can see that there is a clash of interest in this house. Why? Frank. Seriously, love precious. Well, well, well. I am delighted to hear it. Oh, my two sons. Oh, this is wonderful. This is absolutely wonderful. They are my children. Wise as their father. <laughs> never mind, never mind. Um, we shall see how it works out, huh? Frank is your first son. Yes. Traditionally, Val has no right to come between Precious and Frank. Remember, Frank is your first son. So tell me, which of the prince 
Please bow, Mama. Hey! Thank you, Jesus. My goodness. You see, my daughter, you and I suffer so much before they take you. Igwe is our Messiah. He has been so helpful to this family. So tell me, what did you tell him? I told him I would think about it because I want to finish my education before marriage. What are you thinking? You don't have anything to think. All you need to do is go to him, tell him that you have accepted to marry him with Igwe on our side. You finish your studies. Hmm? Don't you like him? Um, he's humble and caring. Don't you like him? I love him, Mama. <laughs> My daughter, I'm so happy. Ah, God is wonderful. God is gracious. Who is like this God? Nothing to compare with him. Oh my God, I'm so happy. You have my blessings. Thank you, Mama. Any day, any time. Thank you, Mama. Ah, oh, you, you. I don't have a I don't, you, you. I'm so happy. Precious. You know, from the time you stepped into the palace and I saw you and I heard all the things that uh, other people are saying about you, I wished you were my daughter. Yes, I tried everything to adopt you so that you can be my daughter forever. But unfortunately, it didn't work out. Until God has decided to do it his own way. But let me assure you, on one, that as far as your education is concerned, no one, and I repeat, no one is going to interfere with it. You will be able to attain whatever height you, you want to. We shall be here to support you. Secondly, uh, anything, anything that bothers you, you let me know. Be assured that I will not allow anything that will trouble your heart. Is that clear? In your age, don't let that bother you. Whatever you want to do it when you want to do it. You just let us know. Nobody is going to stumble on your freedom because of your age. Exactly. And um, my children, well, they, they both um, have made their feelings known to you. You must admit that uh, love and marriage is a very, very delicate thing. So we have to be very careful how we handle things. Hmm? So, what do you think? Igwe, first of all, I would like to thank you for your benevolence. As my mother would always say, you are the source of our life. Who am I that Frank and Val should find me worthy? I like both of them. In fact, everybody in this palace has been so good to me. Therefore, I wouldn't like to be the bone of contention between Frank and Val. But Igwe, Val was the first person who talked to me about marriage and I accepted. Your Highness, I don't know what to do. Precious, my dear, what you have just said, did you say it? Because Val was the first person to mention marriage to you. Or is it because you love him? Your Highness, my statement is based on love and not on first come. 
I love Valentine and I would like to be his wife. Thank you, my wives. Thank you. Well, I asked you to come because of um, the clash of interests of our two boys. What about the girl that we all cherish? We know that in our family, whatever affects one affects all. And uh, Marriage is not by force, it is by choice. No. And uh, as far as my children are concerned, I will always be impartial. You know, because I respect them and I love them very, very much. But it is only fair that I should let you know that I spoke to Precious and she told me that she has found love in Val. Your Highness, this is a plan and it is deliberate. She has found nothing. It is not going to work because I want it. Why do you always sound stupid? Plan what? By you! How can you say anything like that? Almost done. Your father said that uh, Precious has made her choice. That she's in love with Val. But it's a pure arrangement between two of them. It is not going to work. Father, is that true? Of course not. Well, I think it's time I take my stand and I say what's on my mind. Father, I think you're being partial with regards to this issue. What? Yes. yes. And my stand is this. It's either I get married to Precious or no one will get married to her. Simple and period. Frank! Uh, what is your sense of reasoning? How can you make such a statement? By the way, where did you come about this sudden love and likeness for Precious? You never like her. Why now? You're very stupid and silly. Oh, please. Please calm down, okay? Calm down. A woman will always follow her heart. We shall see. Problem to this Ruyu house. Precious. You don't have to go. Fine. Even if you have to go, at least the king has to be away. Okay? I can't wait. Let me go to my mother. This family, I mean, the entire Ruyu family has been so good to me. I can't be the cause of any problem. Precious. Precious.
why I ran away from the palace. There is a big fight now between Frank and Val. <laughs> the royal house is boiling because of me. Hey. My God. Hey. It is not your fault. It is not your fault, my daughter. But this is a big trouble. My God. And we have to apply wisdom. Yes. It is my utmost desire to pay back with a good coin. No, no. Igwe does not deserve this. He's a nice person to us. He doesn't deserve any trouble from us. Hey, my God. God, please, I beg you. I know you are up there. Give me the strength. Give me the grade so that I'll be able to handle this trouble before me. I depend on you, God. Precious. Go. How? Why? When? She has gone to her mother's house. I said why? She overheard you people making arguments. She had to leave. I tried to stop her, but she insisted. She has. So this is their plan. I said it. They planned it all. It's their plan. But they will not succeed. Um, where did you say Precious went to? Dad, she went to her mother's house. She have had your arguments. She decided to leave. I tried to stop at least to make her get to a consent and let you know before she go. She insisted, she refused. So she has the temerity to leave this palace without my consent. Where can she go? to the other. know what else to do to get my two boys to sheath their swords. The fact remains that uh, Frank is the eldest and supposed to get married before Valentine. The emphasis now is no longer who marries first, but who to marry. The young girl made her choice, but Frank has refused to accept it. had been on who will first marry. I would suggest that uh, Valentine will wait until Frank gets married. Right. 
But uh, owing to the situation at hand, the young girl has made her decision. And we should allow her to carry on with her decision. I mean, her choice of marrying Val so that peace will reign in this palace. The only thing we have to do now is to apply wisdom, you see. He has refused to accept his unworthiness as proven by the girl. Anyway, uh, the only thing I believe that has no solution is that, like I said earlier, we need to apply wisdom. Hmm. Wisdom is the world. But now that you're here, please. Oh, good afternoon, please. Okay. Good afternoon, please. Okay. But now that good you're afternoon. Here, I want you to understand that Frank is the heir apparent to this throne. He is the first son. Please make your daughter precious to understand that. That if she marries my son Frank, she will become the next queen of this kingdom. I don't know if I should call this a blessing or a curse. You see, upon all the kindness this royal household has shown to a poor widow like me and my daughter, I can't stand and watch it end this way. In fact, that is the reason why I'm here to apologize to Igwe. Uh, there's no need you apologize to our father. <laughs> there's no need. I mean, you've not done anything and your daughter hasn't committed any crime. It's just that my silly brother has refused to acknowledge the culture and tradition of our people by respecting my very self as his senior, as the first prince. But trust me, I will make him see reasons to that. Hello, madam. Val, how are you? I'm fine. Oh, I can see. Where is Precious? My son, uh, I don't know. Excuse me, madam. Um, can't you see we're discussing? Are you stupid? Did I just interrupt you? Of you course you did interrupt. Are you okay? Are you sick? Frank! Are you mad? What the hell is wrong with you? What do you mean? Love is not by force. What are you talking about? Stop fooling yourself! What do you mean by that? Who told you she loves you? You're a madman! You're you a silly man! You're Frank! Please, she doesn't me. love you! She, she can never love, love you! you. She, she will you. never ever love you! Please, you're please. confused! You are you're a madman! You're a big man! Get out! Out! Get out! Hey, madam, don't touch me again! I will beat you and your son! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Frank is small. Are you serious? You're small. You're just bigger than Full of lies and self esteem. Stupid jokes. I will crush you. I will mess you. Don't tell me. 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 Don't tell Please, if I handle you, please. you will go deaf and dumb and blind. Get Don't try me. Get out of here. 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 Get out of Get out of here. 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 Get out I will make you miserable. I will frustrate you. I even doubt if he's our father's true son. I wonder. This is what happens when when you place a monkey with low self-esteem in a royal home. This is what you get. They came to drag property and things with us. Just look at them. Let's go. Please, Igwe. We cannot afford to make you unhappy after all you have done for my family. My daughter has found so much favor in your hands. Please, forgive us. We're sorry. How could she? How could she leave the palace without my consent? Yes, I, I know how she feels. But she should have seen me first. Please, Igwe. I'm sorry. Forgive her childish act. She's only a child. And she has not been in this condition before. 
It's all right, woman. Sit down. It's all right. Sit down. Sit down. Woman. Your daughter found so much favor in this royal household. We've all seen the situation on the ground. Though it's not her fault that she's an embodiment of beauty. You have to join us to apply caution and understanding in this matter. It is your duty to let her know that she has the decision to make. The choice is hers. And her choice she must follow. Okay. Make sure she sees me as soon as she contacts you. She will see you immediately. She's my daughter. My daughter. Nothing. And I repeat, nothing must happen to her. Yes, Your Highness. She will see you immediately. Mom. What's there? It's not as easy as you think. Wow. Have you forgotten that I was the person that brought this girl into this house? And I don't like Russian things. Okay? Maybe all you need to do is pray over it. Who knows? Maybe both of you are not meant to be. You know I'm not good with women affairs. But in this case, this girl has been with us for so long. And I've become fond of her. Mother, I love her. I truly love her. And I, I can't see myself loving another. I don't mind the fact that she's still in school. But I'm ready to wait. Because what I feel for her is real. I am ready to wait till she's of age and she has rounded up with school and we will get married and spend the rest of our life together. That's what I want. Frank doesn't love her. Frank doesn't love her one bit. And you know it, Mama. You know it. He just wants to get on my way. Is said to be wise when one separates what should be separated and together what should be together. And it is also said that the gentle stride of a tiger is not a symbol of cowardice. You have to apply wisdom, for wisdom serves as a key bread to a man's journey and as a safety belt to a drowning man. No one knows when one is being saved from an illumined danger. You know your brother Frank. Both of you grew together. He will go extra mile to make sure that girl accepts him. Frank. All 
I love that girl. I truly love her. Frank is just being weak because he never had interest in her. Only Frank knows what made him all of a sudden develop interest in a woman that I love. My dear, it is the protective coloration of a chameleon that saves it from the hands of its enemies. I know it will be very difficult, but you have to try as much as possible to forget that girl and watch and see how she's going to live with Frank. I think that will be the right step in the right direction. to withdraw. What? Mother, love is not by force. Frank can go ahead and marry her. I've just discussed with Uncle Ozo and I've realized that I can prove my love for her by letting her go. Oh, that would be better than putting our lives in danger. Let the will of God be done. I've always known that this is a wicked world. But, but there is nothing I can do about it. I know it. I know it deep down that Precious loves me. She truly loves me. What do I do? Well, I pray that Frank will love her for real. Pray so. Precious. Oh, precious. It is not your fault that this is happening. It is just that I don't like the way you left the palace. Since you stepped into this house, I have always treated you like my own daughter. And when my children express their feelings towards you, I, I was overwhelmed with joy. It is only unfortunate that uh, they have refused to shift ground for each other. I wonder, Your Majesty, 
etc. So you see, my daughter, if either of them marries you, it is just like me marrying you. It is just that um, it is against our customs and tradition for the second son to get married before the first son. But... But... Oh! Precious! 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 Your Majesty, it is with caution that one makes a heart swell. Please calm down. Just calm down. Mama, please, I want you. Precious. Well, oh. well, I'm so sorry, okay? Please forgive me. I love you. I'm going crazy over all this. Precious, I love you too. Okay? I love you. That's why I have to let you go. What? Love is the ability to let go. Okay? I have to get you out of this problem. Look, just, just, just let him prove his love for you. Trust me. Please. I'm going crazy. It's okay. It's okay. Just relax. Relax. Let's go inside. Can you imagine the rubbish? Can you imagine the nonsense? Do you know that Precious actually left here only to go and meet Val? Why should that be the fault of the palace? I wonder. Is this what I get for all, all the goodwill? No, I'm going to stop all this nonsense. Val, you shouldn't be saying you should actually be on my side and not... Father, please can I talk to everyone? I have realized that love is not by force. Sometimes God uses one or two things to prevent us from an unknown doom. And to prove my love for Precious, I have decided to let go. I swear by this palace that what I am doing now is from my inner heart, without grudges. Frank is my brother. We cannot kill each other because we want to prove love. No. Father, please forgive me for being selfish all this while. Forgive me, Father. Get up, son. I, I am happy with your decision.
come and meet me. Frank, come here. I saw you standing with Val. What were you talking about? Well, um, nothing really. Um, I told him that um, he's not only my brother, but he's also my friend. And um, I made him see reasons why he should accept the fact that uh, I'm now with Precious. You know, everything is fine. To top it up, um, we are reunited again. Don't be a fool, Frank. You think he did that with his eyes? <laughs> you better be at arm's length with him and wash out. Please. Mom, you don't have to say that. No. Come on. See, myself and Val, we know each other. And trust me when I say Val and I know each other better than our mothers know us. <sighs> Everything is fine, okay? I know when Val is faking and I know when he's real. It's okay, but just be very careful. Sorry, if you'll excuse me, please. Please. Family, I welcome you all. Igwe, you've been a light to this family, and it is God Almighty that will reward you abundantly. Yeah. Having gone through the list of items for the marriage rite and found them complete, we don't have time to waste. Igwe, Precious has been like your own daughter, and today. She's becoming your daughter-in-law. Yes. Well, I mean your wife. <laughs> precious. Can, can the precious? What am precious Eva? Bring her here for me. Custom demands. Yes. Precious, it is now time to hand you over to Igwe, who will give you to his son, your husband. Step up here. Igwe, 
I hand over to you. I think I will get up for this. <laughs> My people, I thank you. I thank you very, very much. Today, I am the most happy man in this millennium. And I am happy because God has granted my wish. God in his almightiness has granted my wish. All glory and honor be his. Precious. My precious. Time to hand you over to your husband. Precious. Igwe, I thank you. Precious. I know where you belong. Come. What is the meaning of this friend? What? Frank, what is the meaning of this? What's the meaning? My people, I know you're shocked at what I just did. I did it because I have realized that the root of marriage is love. Months and years have passed. And I cannot deny the fact that I know that my brother Val has nothing but undying love for Precious. My brother Val is a gentleman. God fear. One who believes in the ways of nature. And one who believes that things must go in accordance with God's will. Well, precious. Congratulations. <clears throat> so be it. So be it. Is it by your Yeah. Grandu? Yeah. Grace yeah. Lundu? Yeah. You are a prince with a large heart. That's very good. My prince, he shall do all My son. Should Frank suddenly become so weak? This was not our agreement. How could he take such a decision without my consent? How could he take such a stupid decision without my consent? Hmm. Imagine. 
if I should let this happen, my first son, the heir apparent, will become the last. No. No. This is not ordinary. Something is wrong somewhere. Yes. I won't let this happen. I have to find out. Yes. I have to find out. Could you make such a useless decision without my consent? Useless decision? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mom, I thought everyone was happy with my decision, so why are you sounding this way? Happy? You want me to be happy when you are almost losing your right in this kingdom as a first son? Mom, I am not losing no right. I've realized marriage is all about love. Val and Precious love each other, so why don't we let them be that get a funeral out of this? Frank. I can see that you are out of your mind. You are out of your mind, Frank. And what is happening to you is not ordinary. Besides, you can be in love with a woman. It's just a matter of time. Ah, uh, Mom, why, why don't you just let things die the way it has died naturally? Let this issue just die. I'm happy with the way things are. Really? Yes. I can see that you have been charmed. But not to worry. You can go ahead and be happy with them. As for me, I won't let go. Nonsense. Why wouldn't you just let things be? Why? I'm not going into no miserable marriage. What is it? <sighs> Wish me luck. Okay, good luck. I know you love Chelsea, right? Mm -hmm. I'll use them right here. Yeah. And finish up this game. Okay, you guys call now. Ah! I missed. Miss. Mm. Oh my god. Yeah. Ouch. Oh. oh. <laughs> Good morning, Mom. Good morning. Good morning, sweet mother. Good morning, my children. How was your night? So special, Mom. Yeah, um, my night was good. I can see both of you. We make a good couple. Rob, what about your mother? I guess she's at the back yet. Okay. Mm. Okay, baby. That's the game. Yes. Sweetheart, give me a glass of juice. Mm. Okay. And give me one for yourself, too. Yes. Ah, uh, don't worry. I'm right here. Uh In my heart took away my sleep. I couldn't sleep a wink all night out of joy. <laughs> Even me. Frank really surprised everyone. Yes. Oh, yes. He really, really made me proud. Uh, like father, like son, eh? <laughs> <laughs> you know, that boy is really like me. Yeah. Oh, I'm going to surprise him. He deserves it. I am. Um, I am the happiest woman. Oh, 
Yes, me too. I am the happiest father on this earth. <laughs> uh, Val and his wife are inside. Oh, yes, they're playing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my king. Um, what delicious meal would you want me to prepare for you this beautiful one? Mm. My dear, anything. You are marvelous. Except rice. <laughs> the dining will be set soon. Oh. <sighs> My prayers. My prayers have been answered. What do you say about your brother's decision? Frank made a better decision, Mom. He expressed brotherly love. We are together. Oh my God. Chooks, are you supporting the senseless decision that your brother took? Is that what you are saying? What is senseless about Frank's decision? should I have been shot. I don't understand. What are you trying to say? Why are you driving at? So you are in support of the marriage of the second son over the first son? Don't you know that your brother, Frank, is the heir apparent? Whatever the case is now, Val must not marry. I say, Val must not marry before my son. Frank, your own brother, is the first son of this kingdom. Jokes. Your father, the Igwe, has placed a very big price on Precious. My dear, Precious is your brother's right. So, Val must not marry before him. Mom. Oh. Frank simply applied positive wisdom. Mm. Eh? We all rejoiced together. Mm. Mommy, I'm becoming so suspicious about this. Eh? Listen, Mom. Let us bury every hatchet. If there is any. Eh? We all together. Father. Good day. What are you doing? Um. Charmed. My children have been charmed. What is wrong with them? Do not agree. I will not agree. Frank is my first son, the first son of this kingdom, and he must marry before Val. Yes, he must marry before Val. Uh, you shall live long. Amen. Uh, you shall be friends as well as lovers. Amen. So that when love fades, friendship sustains. Amen. So, uh, you, will, you will have the fruit of the womb in this marriage. Amen. You will have boys and you will have girls. Oh. Uh, you will know happiness. Oh. All this we ask in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Cheers. You know what to do. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Your Highness, <laughs> this is so nourishing. <laughs> mama! Hey! Oh, my Gis, last to be. <laughs> is that you? Yes, Mama. <laughs> You've got to be. Thank you, Mama. Ah. Mama, how are you? I'm fine, my daughter. Mama. Please, you have to forgive me for not attending precious marriage ceremony. It's okay, no problem. I was having my exams. <laughs> so how did it go? It was fantastic. Really? It was indeed a very big and royal ceremony. It was colorful. Oh my God, I missed 
so much. Mama, I must go and see Precious at the Palace. So. I'll okay. see you later. It's okay. Yeah. There's food inside in case you're hungry. Mama, keep the food. I'll come back and eat the food. Let me see Precious first. It's okay. Okay, Mama, see you Give later. Tea. <laughs> yes, Give tea. Yes, <laughs> ma'am. Give tea. So are you alone? Yes. Maybe not now. Really? Yeah. So, how was their reaction over that decision? Ah, it was so, so nice. So nice. I mean, despite the fact that I took them by surprise, and they were so happy with my decision. Especially my father, you know. And I must say you're such a genius for coming up with such an idea. Oh, baby, come on. I have to. The nanny came in between you and me. But I'm happy that God has done His will. Yes, I'm also happy. So we're safe now. Very safe. <laughs> Marriage is love, like you said. Mm. I prepared your favorite. So let me come up with it. Really? Okay then. Just give me a brief time. I will, of course. That's my baby. Mm. All right, darling. All right. Your Majesty, may your reign last for eternity. He said, My people, you will all bear me witness that we've had our fear. His Majesty has really fed us in celebration of our new couple in the kingdom. <laughs> your Majesty, from the depth of our hearts, we say, Long live the king. He said, Thank you. Thank you very much, also, my brother. Thank you. Uh, I am indeed very happy today. Oh, I am very happy. I am still uh, swimming in the bed of joy over the new couple the kingdom has. You all remember I promised that I will surprise whoever wins the hand of uh, Precious. Yes. Today is the day, and I am going to surprise you. Come, come with me. Come, 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 come. <laughs> My people, uh, the day Precious stepped into this house was the day my joy was full. I am a very happy man today. Happy because God has been kind to my household and especially to me, enabling me to see my son get married. Oh, glory be to God most high. Uh, my son, I told you I will surprise you. It is still my intention to do so. But I say it shall be well with both of you. Amen. Oh, you will live long. Amen. Oh, this union will be a very fruitful one. Amen. You will have boys. Amen. And girls. Amen. Uh, my dear, uh, this is a bangle given to me by my mother. I give it to you. Oh, Your Highness. Thank you, Your Highness. You're welcome. Also, You're thank welcome. you. <laughs> <laughs> this is your car. Oh my God, Your Highness, 
And I'll give the key to Frank, your brother, to give to you. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Highness. Yes, Thank and uh, my surprise as a special wedding gift. Um, I shall give you a check for 50 million naira. Oh my god! Wow! Oh my god! Thank you! You are Thank you, my god! Oh, thank you! You're welcome. You're most welcome. You're most welcome. Thank you. Oh, Congra. Congra. Congra, you deserve it. Thank you, Father. Oh, oh baby! Oh, baby. Oh, you are so good. Oh, thank you. Go on, go on, go on. Oh, your car. Okay, you first. Okay. <laughs> thank you, your Iris. Oh. It's open. Oh. <laughs> I will let her drive for the first time. Oh, yes, yes, please. Oh, I will. Wow. The engine is on. Oh. this morning. I saw your mother. Hmm? Nee, I'm sorry for being absent in your traditional wedding. Yeah? My son was so tight. Please forgive me. It's okay, auntie. It's alright. I understand. So, tie is everything. I'm fine, no. You never told me everything. Hmm? Happy for you. You are really a destiny child. Hmm? Auntie, God has been very wonderful. My traditional wedding was a very big ceremony. <laughs> In fact, I now see myself as the most blessed. You are, my dear. Auntie, Igwe just gave a car and a huge amount of money to my husband and I. <laughs> he also gave me this bangle. So, cute. Auntie, I still can't believe that this is real. It's just like a dream. It is not a dream, my dear. It's happening to you. You are now his daughter in law. You deserve it. All of it. It's okay, Auntie. Please, let's go inside. Let me find something for you to eat, Auntie. Let's go. <laughs> Is Frank blind? Is he blind? Oh my God! Doesn't he know that he's the heir apparent? That everything in this palace belongs to him? No. I will not allow this to happen. To not happen. So long as I live, I will not allow this to happen. <sighs> Frank must have to face the realities of life. I must have to stop him. Frank, did you see what happened out there? Oh yes, I did, and it was splendid. Oh my God, Frank, wake up from your sleep. Wake up from this slumber. You are right as a person in this house, sleeping off your hands. Wake up before it is too late, my son. Mom. Aren't you tired of fighting me over this issue? I strongly disagree with you. Yes, because that showed fervently that my right as the first prince still stands. And my respect stands too. And that is why he gave me the bangle first before I handed it over to Val and Precious later. Is that so? Yes. So you allowed that camouflage out there to entice you? Frank, 
When did you, my smart son, become a dog brain? When? I can see that you are losing your senses. You are not in your right senses. Fine. Wake up before it's too late. Why? Why won't she accept that the will of God has been done and there's nothing she can do about it? No matter what, I'm not joining her in her ordeal. That's simple. You are going out. Yes, Your Highness. I want to rush to see my friend Veronica. She came back from uh, Dubai this morning. I asked her to get some things for me. Um, are you driving alone? Yes, at least for today. I promise I won't be long. Open the gate! I am actually waiting for the first day that car will hit the road. Mother, today is the day. Oh yes, yes. today is the day. <laughs> <laughs> so, bros, which particular shopping mall are we going to Baby, what do you think? Um, I think palms would be okay. Palms? <laughs> we do the palms, boy. Palms? Oh yes. Oh, but I believe I'll get something from there. <laughs> and you will surely get what you want. <laughs> Mother. How do we look? Splendid. Baby, flaunt it. Flaunt it. Okay. Uh-huh. Exactly what I wanted. Okay. <laughs> Show them what you got. That's what it is. Exactly. We're a perfect match. <laughs> Thank you, Mama. Today, baby, I'm driving. Till you learn how to drive. Okay? As you wish, my friends. Isn't she beautiful? Oh, she is. Baby, step down, step down. Okay. Just give us a catwalk right here. Mm -hmm. That's what it is. Oh, yeah? Are we joking? <laughs> this is the hottest. Oh, Mother, happy. we have to hit the road. So happy. Um, okay, my dear. Uh, remember those salad condiments I asked you to buy? Or any, any other thing you can remember? I won't forget, Mother. Okay. Mother, what are we having for lunch? After you come back. It's always a secret. Ah. <laughs> I know you're sad. <laughs> okay, baby, let's hit the road, okay? Oh my goodness. Mother, mm. watch her take some steps now, yeah. right? Okay. Oh Let me God. see you off, please. Oh <laughs> there we go. There we go. You see, um, my father having known that I've been seeing someone and also knowing that this someone has been coming to visit me at the palace, hasn't been totally happy and really he has been worrying me over the issue of having a wife and that's why I invited you today to properly introduce you to him baby it's okay but I have something I would love to say before we go I missed my call you know what I mean you missed your call Like you're pregnant? Yes. <laughs> wait, you're, you're pregnant? Wait, wait, hey, 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 hey. I know you're joking, right? This is a joke, you're not serious. Honey, but you know I've never joked with such before. I'm dead serious. You're pregnant? <laughs> you're really pregnant? Look, baby, we have to go see my father now, now, now. Come here! Are you too pregnant? Oh my god, oh my god. Oh, my 
This is Jennifer, my sweetheart, my darling, my love. Uh, Jennifer, my father, His Royal Highness the King. You are most welcome, my dear. Sit down. Um, Father, I... I was actually going to uh, bring Jennifer here to properly introduce to you. Uh, but uh, before we came here, she told me about a situation I think I should share with you. Um, Jennifer here is um, presently pregnant for me. Pregnant? Yes. Well, well, well. My dear, you are most welcome. Thank you, Majesty. actually meaning to introduce her to the kingdom as my future wife uh, but before we <laughs> met dad here uh, she told me that she is presently pregnant for me. Pregnant? <laughs> I can't believe this. This is good news. My dear, you are welcome. Your hands. I'm overwhelmed with joy. <laughs> I'm happy. My dear, this is for me. Excuse me, this is good. Oh, yeah, 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 it's good. Now, now I agree that you are my son. Ah. <laughs> I shall surprise you. <laughs> oh, yes, oh, yes. You are a man, you are a man now. Oh, yes. <laughs> so, you have to go. Now I meet her parents, um, set a date, and make all the necessary arrangements. And on that date, we are going to complete all the marriage rights. I'll do that. Huh? I'll do that. Yeah, Maka. <laughs> you are now a man. Hatred. Since Frank, my son cannot have you. No one else will have you. Not even Val. Hatred. Absolute hatred. That is what my heart desire. That is my heart desire. Confusion. Confusion. Hatred. Precious and chicks. 
I don't know anything about them. What do you mean you don't know anything about them? What's the meaning of that? Mother. Why didn't you come back with her? Mom, I can't really understand this. On our way to the market, Far stopped. And other Precious down from the car. Huh? See, I was surprised. Precious is like a sister to me. So, I had to come down too. Did you exchange words? No, nothing like that at all. So, are you trying to tell me you didn't buy what I asked you to buy? Mother, we never got to the market. He will talk to me tonight, okay? <coughs> Let's go. Get out! Get out! Get out! Are you mad? Get out! Get out! What is this? You must leave this house! Fire has come over! What is this? You must leave this house today! What is your problem? <laughs> So you are back on this again today? Look, we can imagine. Val is beating up his pregnant wife. Ah! She must leave this house today. Today, she must leave. Oh, precious, come. Come with me. Come with She better leave, though. She better leave because I'll kill her. You can't do it like that. will kill you. This is madness. You will kill her. I'll kill her. You can't do it. Ha! Oh. Ha! I'll kill you. I am your father. I'll kill you. And nothing. Nothing and no one can do anything. Let's go. What? My prince, you're welcome. Thank you very much. I know Igbo for the very well. He's a nice man. And I appreciate the fact that my daughter has been found worthy to be the Igwe's daughter in law. I have no objection to that at all. Uh, thank you, sir. Thank you. As for the date, uh, from now till the end of the year, it's free. So you just pick it in and inform me so that I can reach my kinsmen. Now, what do I say but thank you? Thank you very much. I feel very honored and welcomed by your kind gestures. Sir. That's all right. Uh, I'll definitely get back to my father, and uh, the palace will get back to you with news regarding to the date. Uh, but sir, if you'll excuse me, I have somewhere I have to go to immediately. That's alright, that's alright. Alright, sir. Uh, send my regards to the king. I will definitely miss him. Yeah. is upstairs burning up. Speak to me, son. Father, I have my reason for whatever that I'm doing. And as a matter of fact, Father, I have nothing more to say to you. Val, what is it that she has done that burns your head? This is a shame to this kingdom. Don't do it. Everyone was praising your relationship with Precious. How come you want to throw it to the dogs? Why? The best thing for her to do is to leave this palace. Else, I will kill her. Father, if this is why you called me, I plead to be excused. Val! Val, come! Val! Your Highness, let him be. 
You know Val doesn't talk much. And no one is perfect. Precious must have done something extraordinary that is only known to them. Oh, quiet! Don't say what you don't know. Precious practically grew up in this palace. Ah! that be? Val is our son and we know him only too well. But have we tried to interview Precious thoroughly enough to find out if she's truly innocent? Or has she done something to upset Val? Mm. I think you have a point there. Good. Now, we have to do it immediately. Val has refused to talk. So Precious must talk. So that we know when we are supporting evil. Precious? Precious. Yes, my queen. Please come. Mom, you called me. Yes. <sighs> Precious. There is something that has been bothering us all this while. We don't like what you are undergoing through the hands of my son, Val. You see, Val is my son. And I know him so well. He can't just start misbehaving without reasons. So, tell me what I don't know. <laughs> Mom. I can never lie to you. <laughs> Even if I can lie to myself, I can never lie to you. <laughs> I have not done anything wrong to her. <laughs> I want nothing but the truth. Tell me the truth behind your pregnancy. You know I love you so much, or I will walk out on you now. <laughs> Mom, please. Please. I've not done anything wrong to Bob. May God reward me with madness. You Mom, please. You're my strength in this palace. Oh, please, do not leave me. Do not reject me, please. Get up. Stand up, stand up. It's okay. Go back to your shoes. Hold her! Warn this girl! Do you understand? The only reason I will not cut off her head in this compound is if you take her away! Take, take her away! Look at 
coffin? If you don't, get ready to get her a coffin. No sir. Is this a joke? What's going on? What's the matter? It's alright, come, come, come in with me. No, I'm not giving me. No, 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 no. While I was in my bedroom, went to the kitchen, broken plates all over. Does that want to kill this girl? Father, what is going on? I mean, what exactly is going on? I've known Val all my life. I grew up with him. I know him like my bare hands. He's never taken drugs before. He's never taken Indian hemp. And he can't start now. Just look at what he did to Precious. Very shameful thing for me to be alive with my eyes open and watch my stepdaughter pregnant with my grandson leave the palace because of an idiot? No! If he thinks he's mad, then I am madder. We'll get to the bottom of this. I thought my sorrows are gone. I check when no fulfill may be gone. If none of me are more, now I'm ready What have I done? I have to see you. All right, son. She's a poor guy, she be the love. Are you going out? As you can see. Well, I need to speak with you. Go on. You and your wife have been having problems. So I want to know what the problem is. I need you to talk with me, brother to brother, man to man. What is the problem? My problems with my wife is solely my business. I have nothing to say to you. Va. But you must give a dog a name before you kill it. Come on. Come on, I have talked with your wife, asked her severally, and she says she doesn't even remember saying anything bad to you or doing anything evil to you, so what is the problem? Then prepare to eat her head or send her away. Excuse me. Are you walking out or what do you think? Va, you're about driving out on me? What type of marriage is this? Good. What is wrong with my daughter's fortune? Can I beg you? Mama, it's okay. God is not blind. He knows why everything is happening like this. I believe he will provide the solution. Yes, he will provide his solution. But will he be understand me? My daughter is pregnant and I can't bring her back here. 
If I do, it's as if I am biting the fingers that feed me. His Royal Highness is a nice man, and I don't want to fed him. Mama, it's about life and death. Precious life is at stake here. I suggest she should come back, and after putting to bed, she may go back to the palace. You're right. You are right. But will Her Royal Highness understand this? That man has been the source of light. My life depends on him. Mama, it's okay. Hmm? It's okay. Go back with the solution. Hmm? It's okay. Girl, you know what's up, right? Yeah, put your hand right here. That's my baby. Father. Val. Come. That's my father. Father. Good evening. And uh, who is this girl? She's my wife. For now. Are you looking at me? What? Hey! Oh, what's going on there? Are you crazy? What nonsense? Let's go! Hey! What? What? What's wrong with you? What you doing? What's going on here? Hey! Let her go! Leave it him. Right. Leave him. What's going on here? Fuck! Alright! What's up with you? Let her go! Leave him. What's up with you? Are you mad? Don't you? Are you stupid? Now will you shut up? My roof. Mother, what is it? This thing slipped under my roof. Mother, calm down. How can you call this beautiful, sexy girl a thing? Please, mother. She's the most beautiful girl in the whole wide world. And now she's my princess. You chose that idiot for me. So why don't you go ahead and marry her for yourself? I got myself a princess now. No! Mother, leave her alone! No! Mother, stop it! Something wrong with you! What's wrong with you? What? Something wrong with you? What is it? Are you sick? Fuck! Are you mad? Is this your business? It's my business! Please! It's my business! Why would you push your mother because of this thing? What's this? Frank, leave me alone! You, excuse me! Excuse Frank, please! Please! Talk to this boy! Please! You! Please! Frank! Get out of here! Frank! Get out! Frank, this is not your business! Get out of this! It is my business! Come here! Are you a fool? I have had it up to here. I am sick and tired of asking you to explain, to let us know what is the cause of this rift between you and Precious. But you, you wouldn't open up. Things have got so bad 
So bad now that you, 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 you're fighting every member of the family. So I have called a meeting of the family so that you can tell us the reason or whatever or the cause of the problem you have with Precious. After all, you can't be, you can't be bigger than the family. And I am assuring you right now that if we find Precious guilty, she will instantly be sent back to her family. But if we find that she is not guilty, then we shall pursue and make sure we find out who the guilty party is and bring them to book. Father, I maintain what I've always said. Precious is a witch. What? And I have to send her away. I have nothing more to say, Father. But, Nova, there is no smoke with that fire. The reason can be unspeakable. What do you know? Listen, I don't know why we are begging Val. Val has made up his mind. If Precious wants to go, let's her go. Val will marry whoever he wants to marry. Shut up if you have nothing to say. How could you say a thing like this? How? A very. Never you again in your entire life. Speak to me in that manner. Anyway, it serves you right. This is a reward for desperation. Nonsense. Desperation? Desperation, you said? You are the desperado. I think you are the desperado here. Only imagine. They were trying to reconcile me with that. That idiot. They don't want to hear me out. This is my life. I choose who I wish to marry. It's my choice. I'm a full grown man. For God's sake. That's it. You. You. Let me tell you something. Today will be the first and the last day you have to run for Val in this house. Then let me see the thing you touch her. Then you kill me first. I'm to you, stupid, she slut. Let me see how it is. Fool! Idiot! Rubbish! Mother, marriage is not by force. It's not by force. My son, you see what is happening between Val and his wife? So I want you to think very, very carefully about your feelings for that girl. Father, though I'm very disappointed at Val, I say forget about his silly change of mind. As for me, I've dated Jenny for a very long time. We know what we're doing and we're ready to go. Okay. By the way, what did her parents say? Well, they said we can choose whatever date we desire and they will be comfortable with our decision. That is nice. That is very, very thoughtful of them. Um, so, next Saturday? I, I, I think that is too soon. Mm. What about um, the upper Saturday, the 27th? That's better. Good. So, you go back to them and let them know that we are agreeable. I'll do just that. And. Uh, Please, my son, consider the old man's heart. Think very carefully about your feelings for that girl. Father, like I said, I know what I'm doing. 
And I dare say you can curse me if you get disappointed, but trust me, I will not disappoint you. Have a nice day. Bless you, son. Bless you, my son. Bless you. Bless you. Do a traditional marriage since your people are not in support of our plans and your dad has sworn not to give us his blessings. Don't worry, okay? We'll give them some time. If they don't give their consent, we'll go ahead and start making babies. What do you want? What? What is it? Please forgive me. I love you. I brought you this food that mommy said I should bring. I'll put it. Thank you. Now start eating it. I should eat it. Eat it! Mm. Eat everything. to do now is going to offend you. Please forgive me. Because I am so confused. I am tired of this marriage. Let me go. This is the bank. I'm going home. Precious!
Now, my in law, actually, uh, I came to see you. What nonsense did you just call me? What did you call me? I am not your in law. Get that into your head. Dad! I hope you came to take her away. Because the earlier you do, the better. Precious to come and stay with me. You see, the way Val talked to me outside shows me that he might do something funny to her. And she's just a small girl. Be cool. Sit down, sit down, sit down, sit down. Sit down. I must say that this is most embarrassing for us. That such a thing should be could be happening under our roof without our knowing. It's very sad, very sad. But I can assure you that now that we know, it will never happen again. Yes. Thank you. I'm only waiting for him to come back so I can tell him who his father is. Please, my end. I am here also. And Precious here is also my daughter. And as long as I'm living, Precious will never suffer. Thank you. It's Thank you, my boy. Val no longer beats me. Just that he doesn't talk to me. And um, Mommy and Daddy are always here with me. And they give me courage. Thank you, Igwe. Thank you, my boy. Thank the you. Least we can do. It's okay. I believe that everything will be fine. I believe God. Amen. 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 Um, Precious, please go and set the table. Okay. At least you must eat before you go. Thank you, my boy. Thank you. As uh, my father and I, having uh, looked through our calendar vividly, uh, we have reached a consensus uh, to fix uh, the wedding ceremony for next two weeks Saturday. Next two weeks Saturday? Yes. That should be on the 27th. 27th. That's okay. That's okay. Uh, the, that's what actually I came to relate to you, sir. Thank you. In that case, I have to inform my kinsmen. Uh, sir, I would actually like you to uh, give me this favor, sir. Uh, you see, my father's friends and uh, uh, some of his business associates, inclusive uh, a few of my uncles, will be coming to the palace today for dinner. Uh, if you do not mind, sir, uh, I would really like you to excuse uh, Jennifer to come join us at this dinner, sir. My prince. You know, that is contrary to our tradition. But I can't refuse the prince anything. And when is she coming back? Our oh, first thing tomorrow, sir. You may go with him. Ah, oh, thank you very much, sir. You're welcome. Thank you. Honey, in that case, let me change into something reasonable. Take your time. I'm 
For me to change. My daughter, it's as if you focus so soon. I used to change in a place like this. That was then. Don't worry, just put it on. Put it on, okay? you here to remind you of where you started, in case you have forgotten. <sighs> Precious my daughter, I know you just like I know my name. I want you to tell me the truth, nothing but the truth. I want to know why your husband Val is behaving this way. You see, I'm a woman. And I know that for a man to start maltreating his wife, there must be a reason. Though he no longer beats you. But two of you are not in talking terms. And for a man to excommunicate his wife, there is no marriage. I want you to tell me the truth. I'm all ears. Mama. <laughs> Mama. Even you. <laughs> Mama, so you don't trust me. Mama, before you, I have no secrets. <laughs> You're my everything. <laughs> Even this brilliant here can bear me witness. I am innocent. <laughs> I, I swear, Mama, I, I swear by my head that I have not done anything wrong to Val. God is my witness. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, you know as Christians, we are not 
not supposed to swear. Not even for any reason. Name. You see, Pastor, that is why I decided to consult you. Igwe, the devil is a loser. He has no power over the children of God. Mm. Don't try driving anybody away from the palace. Let them be. Let them stay. If you do, you may spoil so many things. You see, Pastor, what I am afraid of is that uh, that girl may become pregnant for him. She won't be pregnant. She will not become pregnant at all. I'll simply talk to heaven in prayers and God will bring about their separation. That's all right. I've, I've, I've heard what you said. All right. Let us pray. Stand up. Pray in Jesus' name. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Father, we bless your name for the peace. Precious, are you sure you still want to stay? Because I'm afraid. Mama, don't worry, okay? I would have loved to go with you, but my mother-in-law is a very good woman. And she takes good care of me. You still call her mother-in-law? So, is Vast still your husband? Mama, let the will of God happen, okay? Give God. You're leaving without your bag. Anyways, anyhow you want to do it, it's your business. But make sure you do not return to that palace. Mama, don't worry. I will be fine. I don't want to disappoint the Igwe again. Okay? Please, just go. Okay? Let me go back. Mama. Precious. Please, just go. Let me go back. Okay? I will be Listen, make sure that Precious doesn't come into this palace again. Do you understand? But my prince, that's what I should have come from the Igwe. Mind how you talk to the prince, he has the right. Who are you? Do I know you? What do you mean by that? Sorry, my prince, it's just that she's a total stranger. I, I didn't know her. We shall see. Maybe. Come on, darling.
I warned you never to enter this palace again. But you're here eating. Did I warn you never to step into this place again? Precious. Did I? Did I? So nice. I really can't say, my brother. For months now, he has not changed. Still living with that whore. Oh, I'll make them suffer. Oh, I promise you, I'll make them suffer. Tell of doom that the sluggishness of the tiger was not a way of escape for him. He wouldn't have tampered the tiger's story. Far has just beaten precious and she has just slumped. Please come to I 
I want your madness to meet my madness. I'm not going to come down. Val, come out here. If I, if you don't kill me, I will kill you. It's all right. It's all right. Come. Do not walk yourself. I am your father. I talk to you. I beg you. You don't want to listen. No. I will kill you. Okay, your majesty. Val. It's okay. It's okay. Please. 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 I don't want to It's alright, stop shouting. Stop shouting. I will shout, please. I will I shout. Your I will shout. I'm here for the second time to tell you this because you and I know the pains of childbearing. You behave as if you pick your daughter from the goddess. Do you want to see her cubs before you react? Huh? Val. Well, is a mad dog. He beats your daughter every day. The other day he kicked her on the stomach, intending to kill her. Is that what you want? My God, this is not good at all. My win. I don't know what to do. I'm confused. And I don't want to offend His Royal Highness. You don't want to offend His Royal Highness? No, no, did you hear yourself? Your daughter is not a wife to Val, but a slave. Or oh, have you sacrificed your daughter for that dog? Val has another wife, and she's pregnant for him. Please, but come and talk to Igwe. But I believe God that Val will change. He will change one day and come back to his senses. All right. I must be on my way home now. That's yes. whatever you want to do. Please do it fast. Else, your daughter will die. For her mother? No, not yet. Mm. I think we should keep it away from her. Which hospital is she in? Crossfield Hospital. All right. Um, I'll I'll see her later. Constant can change be. 
you beat up your pregnant wife only to frolic with this girl? Frank, let's get something straight. She's not my wife. And you know what? You can go ahead and have her like you always desired. Will you shut up? I'm still your elder brother and forever will I be. Now you listen to me, little brother. You will forever regret what you've been doing to Precious. Because the law of karma will definitely catch up on you. Until then, mind your own business. Come on, baby, feed me a mango. Mm, come on. Um, oh, maybe I should feed you too. Here, yeah, baby. Precious, did you come back with you? Oh no, my dear. Her mother insisted she stay with her for a while. Hey, yeah. Uh, Precious. I can't wait to see her back in the palace. It's okay. She'll be back very soon, okay? You're welcome. Your You understand? I don't know what is happening. I almost died, but thank God for bringing me back to life. This is very ridiculous. Val, wonder so shall never end. Stop, Frank. You had never been kind to me. All of a sudden, began losing me like a baby. understand how much I adore her. <laughs> but... Confused. I think we have to keep on praying. Maybe Val's attitude is going to change. If it does, I'll go back. If on the contrary, I'll wait for another man. That is better. Stop. Before they will kill you for me. After all, you're still very young. Stop crying. Stop. It will be better. Val!
is she? Or why is she? She's still in the theater. She'll put to bed. <sighs> what if the child is a boy? No! No! Precious will not survive with that child. No, I will not let go. No! no. Frank is my first son. The heir apparent. He's the one who is supposed to achieve anything. The first to achieve anything in this palace. No vow! must die with that child. Yes. My son is the heir apparent. Mother. Oh. Hello, me. My wife, I can't find her. Who is precious? Precious, my wife, father. Where, where is she? Father, are you right? Father, I'm fine. I'm okay. Father, what is going on? I can't find my wife. I'm okay. <laughs> Killed her. I, I what? You 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 almost killed her. Oh my god. Oh my god. How? How? How did I do it? What, what, what happened? What happened to me? It's for another time. It's for another time. Oh my god. But your wife is in the hospital. Yes. In labor. For your child.
Thank you. Thank you. I... I am shocked. I am so shocked that the woman, the woman I trusted with my life, I loved her, I trusted her. Set my head on fire. Ah! I can't believe that a woman I called mother can do this to me. It hurts me so much that my own stepmother can plan evil against me. Put yourself together. Your Majesty, what are we going to do about Lola now? I'm afraid it has absolutely nothing to do with me. Frank and Chooks, they have to say there now. Whatever they decide, I abide by. I don't know about Chooks. As for me, I won't even say a single thing to make you change your mind or change your decision, Father. I never knew she could go this length. She has dragged my name in the mud. Entertainment programming from the comfort of your home through our satellite delivered channels in your favorite languages French, English, Swahili, Sri, Igbo, Hausa, Yoruba, and so on. Afarevo Dubbing Services. With the largest number of dubbing studios in Africa, we can help you dub your videos to major languages in Africa Swahili, English, French, Yoruba, Hausa, Igbo, Wolof, Zulu, and so on. Afarevo YouTube, the largest YouTube partner in Africa with over 500 channels of top African entertainment and millions of eyeballs daily. We help thousands of video creators make money on YouTube. Afarevo, the revolution is on.